Hey, what's going on you guys? Synth here, and I'm bringing you another figure review. Let's keep the train going on that. And this time I'm bringing you Marvel Legends 90s Iron Man She-Hulk. Which is weird enough, because she came out in the 90s Hulk cartoon. Not, uh, Iron Man, but whatever. As long as I got her, and thank God I did. Thank you Toy Shiz for that uh, pre-order hookup for Amazon. Of course, of how the packaging is, I usually do that a little afterwards, but how this is, I might just check this out now. So let's take out a quick view right here. We got the, uh, we got the original Marvel Comics from the 90s logo right here. We got Iron Man, She-Hulk, Iron Man right here. Ah, man, I still need to pick him up. We got She-Hulk in her grace right here. On the back, we got a full yellow picture of her and her interchangeable hands. And, uh, and right on top, we got a quick uh, thing. She-Hulk, with her incredible strength and passion for justice, Jennifer Walters fights evil as both lawyer and gamma-powered superhero. And then that's it. That's her brief introduction. <laughs> there isn't much. And that's really about it. So let's bust her out, shall we? And here she is. Oh my god. I'm not gonna lie. I'm actually loving this figure. I I, I will admit I actually have the uh, She-Hulk Attorney at Law TV series figure and if I had it not uh, in storage I'd compare it to this. This is so much better. Oh my god. Which of course it's the 90s. Everybody fell in love with She-Hulk. She first came out. I mean how can you not love this scene from the cartoon? Unfortunately, this is all we got for live action. Compared to this, oh my god, the figure feels amazing. I'm loving the aesthetic and like how it looks and feels. Normally, most uh, Marvel Legend women are like very, it, but of course she's uh, gamma powered, so she's got to have a little bit of muscle right there. But my god, there the detail is quite impressive. Wow, look at that! They got the abs. Everything to the thighs, to the calves. Wow. If her hair was in the way. Oh, look at that muscle in the back. Woo wee! Muscle mommy in the thing. Mm. Dude, I, I really hope they make like a, a 90s uh, cartoon Hulk. I actually want to get that now. The hair feels amazing. Sure, it's uh, hard plastic and all that stuff and you can't move it too much, but. Mm. Paint job to the face is well done. Hmm. Yeah, the paint job is, is really well done to all this. Hmm. A few little scuff here and there, but you know, that, that happens. But overall, not bad. Let's check out the articulation. Of course, uh, very limited at the head because of the hair, unfortunately. Arm, 90. At the shoulder, 360 degrees. Bicep, 360 degrees. Yeah, good double jointed at the elbow. Does the forearm turn? No, it does not. It just looks like it because of the uh, wristband. Hand, 360 degrees. And, oh, good 90 at the hand. Not bad, not bad. The upper torso, but it's, it's got a good swivel motion going on here. The waist does not move. Can't turn that. Oh, good 90. Wow, that's the first. Even with the tookish. Because most, if you've seen my previous videos on most uh, Marvel Legend figures, you cannot get their hand leg up past 45 because of their their ass that's crazy thigh 360 degrees eh, good 45 at the knee it's double jointed not too bad at her calf it does actually turn 360 degrees that's pretty good good 45 at the foot good 90 when it's pointing down it's got a swivel motion checking out her accessories like i said in the beginning of the video she's only got like two interchangeable hands which is two closed fists not bad Details really good right there. And then she has a crush gun snapped in half. And there we go. Hmm. Little height comparison to each of the figures. Extremist Iron Man. Pop-up parade power. Play Arts uh, Tomb Raider. Hot Toys Ahsoka. And that's really about it. Usually at the end of my videos I do a quick history of the character. You already know who the character is She-Hulk. But uh, she, but where the back cover art is from, this is Iron Man. Also known as Iron Man the Animated Series this is an American animated television series based on the Marvel comic superhero Iron Man. The series aired in 1994 to 1996 in syndication as part of the Marvel Action Hour. 
which packed Iron Man with another animated series based on Marvel properties, The Fantastic Four, with one half hour episode between each series airing back to back. The show was backed up by Toy Line with featured many armor variants. Pretty crazy, pretty crazy. But I'm gonna go with another quick uh, origin story where She-Hulk first appeared for me was in The Incredible Hulk 1996 TV series as an American animated television series starring the Marvel Comics character Hulk. It aired for two seasons, 21 episodes on UPN from 1996 to 1997. Lou Ferrigno, who portrayed the Hulk on the live action TV series from 1978 to 1982, provided the Hulk's voice. Huh, I didn't ever actually knew that. That's actually pretty cool. But beyond that, I love this figure. Oh my god, dude. I'm actually impressed. Ah, man, I want to pick up other uh, 90s uh, figures when they come out because I'm actually loving how the detail, the paint job, how it all is and i hope they actually do make a 90s hulk figure because i had actually like to put them alongside with uh, she hulk i hope you guys enjoyed the video and all that stuff if you didn't thanks for checking it out but if you did please hit the human like button leave a comment down below what you thought if you don't like it i'll f find you and if you want to see more videos like this or anything else that's on the channel subscribe hit that notification bell when new videos come out and i'll be catching you guys next time peace